Hey everyone, Surreal K9 here. Welcome back for more to Sky 4 A Promise Revisited. In the last episode, we decided to humor a measle again, and the Netherworld got destroyed again. So in this episode, let's just beat him up again. After I get rid of all these items that were in here. Ooh, Imperial Seal. Uh, I'm not sure, let's put that on the kitty. By the way, in between episodes, I, uh, like I said, I reincarnated all of the main characters. And all the unique characters, anyway. <laughs> not. Retail and Stella are hardly main characters. And in the process, I accidentally leveled up my Sardine Thief to level 15 and unlocked the next tier of his class, which is War Cat. To unlock a new tier of a generic class, you need to level up the previous tier to a certain amount. If I decide to do character demos, I'll list them all then. <laughs> that being said, it is time for time. Hot dog. Yes, hot dog. One, two. One, please. That was my dad asking that these barbecuing hot dogs. Anyway, <laughs> let's go! Forest of... Oh, whoops. Well, I guess you're getting a two-for-one deal today, because I forgot to make progress. <laughs> um, yeah. Mr. Buddy, how you do? Treasure chest, how do you do? <laughs> the zombies can't get past that, that's fine. Imperial Seal! I'm gonna I can't equip that. Can you equip it? Yes. Their ones are nice. They're nice because they raise all your stats, so. There, now the pretty gets it. You know, I'm not even sure why I'm bothering considering these guys are only level 7. Let's just smash them. is worth a lot of SP now, so I'm not entirely sure you're aware of that fact. Huh. Alright, that was a thing that happened. <laughs> Ooh, slippers! Awesome! I know where to get slippers now. Do slippers actually raise my, uh... No thanks. As a matter of fact, they do. Alright, let's put these on somebody. Uh, preferably Mr. The Magetron. And, uh... One on Rutile. Why do I have an... Oh wait, I know why I had an award on her. Whoops. Well, let's... Sort of benefits me doing that. Anyway, let's heal up and uh, get back into the fray with Mr. The Death the Measle Dude person. We can skip the demo here. 
it's just the same thing as before. Alright, so, taking this seriously now, um, we can see that there's an enemy boost plus 50% panel over there, and a disperse damage cube up here. So, our first matter of business is to get past these zombies and uh, take care of that geoblock. Of course, our mage, uh, having none of this, is just going to... Flame the slimes like there ain't no slime. Meanwhile, let's get everybody else up here and uh, do the do. Here I come. All right, Fenric, you can finish the zombie off. Oh yeah, I taught uh, I taught Fenric his uh, next level of fist tech, which is exploding fists. I'll be sure to show that off at some point. Also, I made Rutil the leader of both the uh, training training grounds and the Aura Pyramid, just to uh, give her a bit of extra stats while she grinded back up to 15. She was the last person to reincarnate. Fighter, you are going to hold the line. Uh, everybody else... Space. <laughs> I don't really know how I could have appended to that without it sounding forced, so we have space. Alright, uh, Stella, you take care of that. I'm gonna Send one of my ranged units up that way. Actually, Valvatore, you throw him over there. So, don't have to waste the time waiting for him. I'll turn all of these geo panels red. And okay. So on the next turn we can probably get that uh, green geo cube onto the red panels and uh, set up a dispersed damage zone. Fenric, that's your job. There. Now if we do something this ways. Also, who do you think you are stepping on the like, thing? Brainy dude! You can see that the damage gets echoed onto every member of the same faction over, over on this side. It gets divided between everybody. But that's really none of our concern. One of our pretty dudes can pretty do the dude. And somebody else here needs healing. Alright, now you get up front here. Get ready to chuck Stella over. Fenric too, perhaps. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. Oh, oops. Well, whatever. <laughs> I made a minor miscalculation. So what? Uh, it's not like I'm baking. Get everybody all up in a line. Nice. 
Yes. Yeah, you can see that none of my guys took any of that damage. It was just the enemies. So yeah, disperse damage, unlike this guy at 2, is limited to the same faction. Anyway, here's Exploding Fists. As you can see, it hits a uh, guy two tiles away, brings it to a uh, to, uh, panel of one tile away. Okay. Also, that cat is totally a right the camera. <laughs> Damn cat. Why are you such a cat? Accolade! Okay, we got a level 15 healer, that means. Alright, let's check this out. Rascal, you better start taking this seriously. Also, uh, I need to lower the volume on this before I start getting echoes. I am. You seem determined to win, but I can't feel your determination to kill. Without that, you'll never defeat me. I'm determined to beat the president and whip the corruptment into proper shape. If you really want to stop me, you better be ready to kill me. K kill kill you? That's easier said than done, damn it. That rascal really reacted to the word kill. Although he's deaf, is it possible that he's never taken anyone's life before? And that timidness, he could be the perfect prey. Already. I know you're not a complete printy, but just obey as is. Hm. I'm not gonna back down. No way! I only accept dreams that have happy endings, whether they happen at the end or not! I don't think I've ever met such a troublesome printy before. Fenric, we're going after her. Understood. All is for my lord. And that's the battle. Alright, now, if you'll excuse me, I have a hot dog to eat. <laughs> we'll be right back after this quick, uh, after this quick hot dog break. Bye-bye.